Yo, what's up guys? It's your host, Tomio Daily, <laughs> and I'm back with another video. In this video, we're going to be talking about Hollow Dawn SMP. But, it's the public. Yes, guys, this server is released to the public. See, I'm a fucking savage. I don't care if people know where I live, you know, because I'm nice to everybody. So, damn, I get blown the fuck up on social media. Anyway, guys, so basically, what happened, right? If you guys are curious. Well, for starters, this server is 100% public. Second thing is, it has my real IP, but everyone loves me because I'm nice to everybody. Like, I don't see a reason to be mean to anyone, you know? Anyway, so basically, if you guys couldn't tell, for starters, spawn is going to be 100 by 100. The server was released two days ago. Anyway, we make about $20 a month in donations alone. But, real quick, so I'm going to show you all the stuff this server allows. For starters, spawn protection. Yes, guys, as soon as you pass one block, seriously, just one, ready? One, and then if you pass this block, or this block, this block, it's this block. Once you pass this block, you go to this block, it sets your game mode. Yes, guys, so people can not grief and spawn, which is absolutely awesome. The second thing is, you get effects. You get saturation, instant health, jump boost 3, so you can jump around like all the time you want in spawn. Also, as soon as a mob decides to track you when you're in spawn, check this out. Game mode has been updated to survival, right? You're in adventure mode. As soon as they pass that magic barrier, boom, they disappear. Boom, another one disappears. Boom. But as soon as you go into the world, you lose all your effects. But when you go back inside, you get saturation, instant health, jump boost, speed 4, and resistance. Yes, guys. So spawn is absolutely awesome. Also, there's a couple of commands. By the way, this is 100% vanilla. No plugins, nothing. <laughs> it's pretty awesome. For starters... As soon as you get inside spawn, right, there's a couple things. There's all my command blocks right there, if you guys are curious. Uh, I'm kind of a new back, uh, I'm kind of a pro at Alrighty, sorry about that. Uh, my aunt decides to be annoying and call me while I'm making a video. And I am too drunk to edit. <laughs> I'm pretty wasted right now, so I'm not gonna even edit this video because I'm so drunk. Anyway, that's not the point. I am 21, by the way. So, yeah, anyway, guys, there's a magic barrier, so as soon as you pass this magic barrier, it's a square. Fucking hell, the phone keeps going off. Alrighty, sorry about that. The phone's really annoying. <laughs> It's pretty cool, as soon as you pass this magic barrier, it's a square, it's 150 by 150, right? As soon as you pass it, check this out. Doesn't matter where you're at, if you pass right here, I think, yep, this is where spawn ends, as soon, boom! Your jump boost, everything goes away. But as soon as you go back in, same thing, you get updated to adventure mode. So spawn is 100% protected. Yes, guys, this server is going to be epic. Also, it's 24-7, so you guys can play day and night. Uh-uh, I used to turn, I see the creep in my mind. The creepers blow up my face in death. Also, there's a couple more things. Yes, guys, we have so much. I have an amazing admin right now. He is just awesome. I'm the owner of the server. So... If you guys would like to check it out i'll have the ip in the description yes guys it's a public ip i don't care if you guys want to know where i live uh i don't know what you guys would do because i'm nice to everybody honestly i'm like super nice to everyone uh i haven't banned a single player <laughs> but there's a couple things that prevent hackers you guys ready for it so for starters spawn is 100 protected i have an amazing admin just one uh, i am not looking for admins at the moment 
um i want to get to know people for a couple years before i become before they become an admin anyway if i do this real quick slash game mode creative you can see all my command blocks they are 100 percent done 100 percent organized and everything just like that this is yes guys this is my spawn so we have a lot done <laughs> in two days i have like i said i have an amazing matt admin i just have one at the moment and he's really good at what he does he ha we haven't had to ban anyone because like i said this server is brand new you guys would like to vote for it you guys can um it's just awesome dude it's freaking awesome that's what i've been dedicating all my time to that's why there's no videos out uh for a couple days now i do apologize but we're trying to get this spawn looking finished it's 100 by 100 by the way anyway so real quick there's a couple things the first thing is we have a player tag yes guys so when you first join the server this is what happens so obviously you can't do these commands so slash scoreboard um no it's not scoreboard it's slash tag you guys don't have these commands like i said tell me on minecraft remove player as soon as i remove this it so okay automatically here let me pretend to be an actual player so let's go ahead and clear all this flash game mode uh survival so we start the world in survival right it's automatically in survival and it actually updates you to adventure mode as soon as you join the server so this is what happens when you join the play, uh, join the server for the very first time. All right, I'm gonna clear the, I'm gonna clear the chat real quick. Command D. Or, oh yeah, I have to do. There we go. Uh, I forgot how to clear the chat. <laughs> anyway, guys. So basically, when you join a new the new server, right? As a new player, you get added to the tag player, and it happens in it seconds. So for starters, you get a wooden sword, wooden pickaxe, wooden axe, and a wooden shovel. You also get 16 pieces of bread, a leather cap, leather tunic, leather pants, and leather boots. You get all the effects, and this is how you start off. So. Basically, it's 100% survival, 100% vanilla. We do not help at all. We will not hand out anything. We have a couple things to prevent hackers, griefers of spawn, because griefing is allowed on this server. You're allowed to destroy someone's building. If they build too close to spawn, feel free to fucking blow it up, because I don't care. Game mode set to survival. But as soon as, like I said, anywhere in spawn, it's 150 by 150 for the spawn. So as soon as you pass this, boom, updates to adventure mode. You're now in spawn. You're out of spawn, now in spawn. Anyway, you get the point. And then once you're in survival, you're allowed to break anything pretty much. Like, see, I can break this. And yeah, so you're left with absolutely nothing. <laughs> you have no effects whatsoever. If you donate to this server, you will have speed two. Yes, guys, speed two, and you'll have a full set of diamond armor and a full set of a full stack of golden apples golden apples yes guys you will be freaking awesome you guys will be loaded up if you donate so if you guys would like to donate just let me know your in-game name and how much you donated i'll ask you for a screenshot to verify that you were the actual donator and not just your friend and yeah anyway so pretty much that's what's up also another thing that's really cool about this is it's 100 percent run by me yes guys so don't worry about the map resetting or anything the map resets once a year yes guys it still resets but it only resets once a year and all the commands will be the same spawn will look different every single year but it will be awesome anyway so <laughs> that's pretty cool basically anyone who joins this server a fresh join will be right here in spawn and they'll spawn they'll be in adventure mode they can't break anything nothing can be broken in spawn as soon as they leave spawn they can break stuff but yeah guys so this is what's up and more shops are coming soon like i said we only have one administrator but he's an amazing builder like 
a huge, huge, amazing building. Anyway, a couple things. So let's just say you decide, oh, I'm going to be a bad person and I'm going to hack on this server. Lovely. Well, we have just the spot for you. Yes, guys, we have administrators 24-7. So don't think you're going to get away with anything because I can tell you right now, I can spot x-rayers so easily, man. So easily. And because I'm a god, well, I'm not a god at command blocks, but I'm pretty good at them. Anyway, since I'm pretty good at command blocks, right? Check this out. So, we went to the scoreboard team. Uh, well, we joined the team player, right? So, every team has a new thing. So, if I join... Uh, admin for example right um and then admin and then basically i get to see what people have mined diamond wise so for example the fake agnes i'm watching him he's on my list so if i see his name pop up on the game i'm gonna be spectating him the whole time and that's how we catch our x-rayers yes guys so you cannot x-ray on this server we'll catch you eventually and it's not going to be fun because you will be banned. Yes, I'm sorry to say it, but we do not pardon either. <laughs> so once you're banned, you're banned forever. We ban your IP as well as your in-game name. Um, there's no pardoning, like I said. Anyway, so that's the team join admin. If you join the team owner, that's what I am. <laughs> you get to see the same thing. So like I said, fake Agnes, you're on my red alert. So. If you guys would like to use x-ray, just know you'll be banned eventually and all that hard work will be gone. Because before we ban you, we do something very, very sweet. We actually slash score uh, slash team, we put you in jail. Join. J is what it's called for our server. Like I said, you can't do these commands. Boom. You have been bad, Tommy on Minecraft. You will be banned shortly. And then that's what it shows for the whole server. Yes, guys, the whole server can see that you have been bad. You will be banned shortly. And then you see you have been bad. You will be banned shortly. With a... It sets your game mode, clears your inventory. You get blindness and nausea for a minute and 14 seconds. I know it's kind of depressing. But as soon as that's minutes up, if you guys decide to stay on the server, but sometimes we like to ban in a couple hours. It just depends. Anyway, what we do to ban people is slash scoreboard. Uh, no, slash team. So basically, this is how we know if you're banned or not. Slash team list for jail, because that's what this scoreboard name is. It has one member, which is me, because I'm just showing you what it looks like. Anyway, it also says, hi, you get a great name, and everyone knows you've been in jail. Also, if you guys decide to spam the chat like an idiot, well, there's love for that too. We can also set a scoreboard, which I'm working on right now, but I'm kind of wasted in real life. And yes, guys, I'm safe. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not driving. I'm doing nothing but playing video games all day. Anyway, once this scoreboard is enabled, it will basically disable chat for you. So you can no longer type. Anyway, this is what you guys see after a minute and 30 seconds. You guys are stuck in jail. There's no way to get out. Absolutely no way. There's no release. There's nothing. You're just stuck here forever. And you guys can't do anything. You guys obviously can't kill yourself. You guys can literally do nothing. But there is a slash trigger command and it sets your home. But the thing what's beautiful about this is I'm going to figure out a way that the jail tag um, not. Well, anyway, it doesn't matter because if you're in the jail team, it's always going to pop up. So let's just say you do decide, okay, well, I'm just going to trigger my way out of jail and still play some more. Well, obviously an admin banned you. So if you go home, uh, so if you set your trigger to home and then you go home, you're home, right? But 
you're still in jail. You can't get out of jail. And so yes, you guys can escape. I'm going to work on a fix. Like I said, I'm really, really wasted. So I don't know what I'm doing. Anyway, guys, we have a couple command blocks. So the first, well, a couple commands for players. So trigger is what it's called. And what you can do is a couple. So trigger spawn puts you out spawn. Yes, guys. So now you can use trigger spawn to go to spawn and live your life. But there's another one. So let's just say, oh, okay, well, I don't want to live in spawn and I don't want to make a bed. I'm lazy. <laughs> so this is what the beautiful thing about it. Here, let me just show you. Slash TP. Tell me on Minecraft to 1,000, 100, uh, 1,000. As soon as you go anywhere past spawn, your game mode updates to survival, you fall, you get effects, and so let's just say I want to set my home right by the squid. So this is my home, right? So all I got to do is slash trigger, and any anyone can do this, guys. Set home. Boom. That's it. That's all you got to do. It sets your home. You're good. <laughs> and then let's just say you go back to spawn. And then, so you trigger spawn again, right? You're back in spawn, you're happy, and then you want to go back home. Well, all you got to do is trigger home. That's it. Boom! And it teleports you right back to your house. How cool is that? And this, like I said, 100% vanilla. Command blocks only. And yes, guys, this world is very difficult. There's actually going to be a lot more added. For starters, there's going to be a custom mob. Yes, guys, a freaking custom mob every single hour. Every single hour. Well, not every single hour. So once you die, it, of course, you go back to your spawn because your bed wasn't set. But all you got to do to get back to your home is trigger home and you're back right to the action. But there's going to be a custom mob every single four hours in real life. It is called the Hollow Dawn Killer. The Hollow Dawn Killer is a skeleton that spawns inside your hitbox every four hours. And it is aimed to kill AFKers. AFKing is allowed, but not recommended. Also, there will be a Hollow Dawn Moon. The Hollow Dawn Moon, what it does is it prevents players from living luxuriously. For starters, when the hollow moon happens, well, it's lovely. Basically, you ready for it? The custom mob, the hollow dawn killer spawns. Also, there is 10 mobs of zombies, creepers, and skeletons that will spawn with the Hollow Dawn Killer. Like I said, AFK in your house is not recommended because you will die so fast you won't even be able to say, oh, oh. Creepers will blow your house up. It'll be amazing. Speaking of my admin, he just joined. Hey man, uh, recording, lol. All right, so, but that's our admin. He just joined, pretty cool. <laughs> so yes guys um it's pretty crazy there's actually a hollow dawn killer the hollow dawn moon the hollow dawn moon spawns it runs for 30 minutes yes guys the hollow dawn moon runs for 30 minutes and what it does is like i said it joins custom mobs lightning strikes rain thunder the night it stays night for 30 minutes in the game. Oh, and best believe you kill one of the Hollow Dawn things, they spawn every 10 minutes. Yes, guys, they're weak, but they're strong at the same time because they spawn in front of you. They actually spawn inside you. So if you're hiding in a one by one block and you're like, <laughs> I can AFK all I want, they spawn right inside you and they kill you. The things that Hollow Dawns come with. Well, they have a gas head. Yes, guys, they have a gas head. They also are skeletons with. Yes, guys, I know it's pathetic. 
iron swords. And they have leather armor that is blue. If you see a Holodon killer, watch out. They will kill you. They're aimed to kill players. That's the goal. If you're AFK, you will die really quick. Hey, I think you need to take the speed a little down. It's starting to get really annoying while I build. I <laughs> slash game mode. All right. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and fix that real quick. But yeah, guys. So that's pretty much it. This server is, like I said, public. It's released to the world. Anyone can join. So effects, we will set the speed. Um, instant health. Where's speed? Hey, let me find speed real quick. Uh, that's nothing. Oh, yes, it is. Resistance, saturation, and speed. Boom. Let's set the down to zero. Er. Uh, we'll just do needs redstone. Bam. There we go. Got it. <laughs> gotcha. Gotcha, you. Also, set spawn. Also, spawn and home and set home work. Bam! Ha <laughs> ha! Woo! Alright, so as you see, he's an admin. Alright. <laughs> Alright, and what's pretty cool is slash scoreboard, like I said, this is how I am able to spot hackers. Slash team, join, owner, what command do I use? Slash trigger. Um, set home. Alrighty. So it sets his home and then when he runs back home, flash trigger home. Yep. <laughs> He's excited. He's happy. <laughs> I know, right? Uh, I can't wait. Damn. <laughs> but, uh, here, I'm going to tell him. Watch out for Agnes. You find diamond. X-ray. All right, guys. Well, I'm gonna go play. Oh no, I was watching him. LOL. Was the mining mining straight or crooked? Okay. Well, anyway, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!